going to do? 100,000 subscribers. What am I going to do? 100 Reese's peanut butter cups. Hmm. 100 pints of Ben and Jerry's. What? 100,000 calories. Yeah, I don't want to be on here any more than I have to be. It's such a glorious occasion. What am I going to do? Oh, whew. I am ready to go. I think I'm ready for it. 100 calorie pack. Come on guys. Do you actually think I was serious? Yeah, that's a lot of waffles. Hmm, still missing something. Red velvet cake, one of my all time favorites. Now, the real challenge begins. Can I get a, a, a Diet Pepsi, please? And can you guys double check and make sure it's diet? Just I'm really trying to watch my figure. And so, it begins. What is going on, everybody? Oh, hey there. How you doing? Oh, gosh, I hope these are vegan. Oh, what's up, guys? What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another video. 100,000 subscribers. Whew. A number that I never thought I'd reach. I've done so much in 2016, everybody. I did a crazy amount of food challenges, competed in some awesome food contests. I even won a trip to Canada and got to meet Matt Stoney. I even competed in my first IFBB Pro Bikini contest and won first place. Just kidding. Now, but really guys, this has been such a huge year for me and I couldn't be more proud of myself for what I've accomplished, guys. 100,000 subscribers is awesome, guys. In the grand scheme of things, there are channels that are so much bigger than mine and I'll continue to grow, I'll continue to make content and everything like that. You guys know that I like to do stuff like this. Now, but really guys, 100,000 is just another number, but it has been a long time goal of mine. I couldn't be any more proud of myself for what I've accomplished. YouTube, making videos, eating a stupid amount of food has just been something that I've been really passionate about for the past few years and I just, I love doing it. I love seeing the reactions you guys have. I love interacting with you guys. I love you guys so much. You guys are awesome. And that's why I'm doing this video. Am I going to really be eating 100,000 calories? It's like sometimes I think people actually want me to die. It's okay, I get enough of that in the hate comments. Everybody, this is gonna be an awesome video, but I'm not gonna be eating 100,000 calories. It's still gonna be pretty epic though. I can promise you that. So stay tuned for another epic video and another epic cheat day challenge. Let's do this guys. Time to do this. Alrighty guys, I'm all done with a uh, quick stationary ride. Watching some TV. It's time to go to class. See you guys in a little bit. Always wear a helmet, guys. Seriously. Just got back home from class. It's time to go to the store and get this day started. So everybody, I did not prepare properly for this challenge because I have nothing in my fridge. So we gotta go to the store, stock up. Let's go do it. Alrighty guys, so we're on our way to the store right now, the first little trip. 
Now I do want to say that this is not going to be one of those days where I'm going to try to get 50,000, 60,000, 70,000 calories down. It's not about that. It's about having fun. Uh, today is going to be pretty carb heavy, I will say. But everybody, you guys know that carbs are my favorite things to eat of all time. So I'm probably going to get some awesome stuff for breakfast and uh, yeah, go on a little ride after that. But my main point really is I'm going to try to relax with all this, not take it too seriously and have an awesome day. Enjoy it. This is a milestone for me, 100,000 subscribers. I'm going to have fun with this, guys. So stay tuned for the rest of the video. This is my aisle. Time to go to work. This is gonna take way too long. We're gonna have to improvise. And before I sit down for my first meal, everybody, you guys know I gotta do this. Because we're all about health and fitness. Use my discount code. And we can't just have plain old oatmeal. So many carbs. We gotta spice things up a little bit. Alright everybody, so we're gonna get this started. It's already midway through the day. The time right there, the date is 11.53. I got this camera right here, I got that camera right there. I don't even know what I want to do first. Everything that's been hot is probably already cold. But, you know, let's get to it. Cheers to 100,000 subscribers, guys. I really underestimated how much peanut butter was in this. Whew. I just want to take a moment and highlight the importance of fruit, guys. This is very, very important. We gotta really focus on micronutrients with all of this, okay? <laughs> Shout out to Harold. We have the first buttermilk waffle egg sandwich. We need some more syrup though. Much, much better. Much better. I definitely approve of that one. Definitely approve. The last waffle. And the yolk is dripping. Vegans love them. Not really?
Alrighty guys, so all those waffles are down. That was pretty dense, I'm not gonna lie. Kinda regretting buying all of those waffles, but done. And now we can move on to something better. Cold oatmeal with disgusting amounts of brown sugar. Yes, I eat kiwi with the skin on. Hate me for it. Gotta add some honey. Didn't have enough brown sugar. Oh man, it's a lot of oatmeal. Not really though. Kinda feels like it is. My first time ever trying sprinkled donut crunch. Being a cereal connoisseur like I am, this looks really delicious. But looking delicious and tasting delicious are two very, very, very different things. Approval. Sometimes you just gotta eat more cereal. I don't know. I will say guys that this cereal messes up the top of your mouth, the roof of your mouth like crazy. So be wary of that before you buy this. And a few lonely bits of cereal remain. Just kidding, there was one more. Alrighty guys, it's 12.20 right now. So I'm gonna finish off this fruit right here and then we'll see where the rest of the day takes us. Stay tuned guys. And alrighty guys, I am back from my ride. Let's just say I need to eat more waffles a lot more often because that was an awesome ride. As you can see, I am sweaty as hell right now, but it was an awesome ride. We have Santa Ana's going on in San Diego right now, so it's like 85, 90 degrees outside, really, really humid. So uh, that being said, I'm done for the day ride-wise. There she is right there. Uh, feeling good overall. Uh, I mean, I'm di I digest carbs pretty well, so it's not really that big of a deal for me. Uh, I'm gonna go right now, I'll probably go train. And then afterwards, I got a lot planned, so you guys will have to stay tuned for it. I'll see you guys in the gym. Carbs, guys. Carbs. Alrighty guys, so it's about five o'clock right now. We just killed deadlifts. I uh, managed to hit a PR 365 for a triple, so I'm excited about that. I'm even more excited to go to my next destination, so I'll see you guys in a little bit. You've reached your desired destination, diabetes, AKA Krispy Kreme Donuts. And conveniently, you don't even have to get out of your car. You can just go through the drive-thru because we're just that fat in America. I'm actually just going to get a dozen of your original glazed donuts, please. Donut, which is the salted caramel. Ooh. Salted caramel. Uh, let me try, I'll try one of those please. Thank you. Donuts acquired.
And because we didn't want to stop at diabetes, we had to go for obesity too, so. Taco Bell it is. I think you can Taco Bell, go ahead and order when you're ready. All right, uh, do you guys still have your, um, uh, like your 12 taco box or what is that? The, the party box? Yeah, we do. Can I get three of those to be the cooler ranch? Uh, and then do you guys have salads? We have the campino bowl and then we have the beef taco salad. Let me just get the uh, the beef taco salad, please. I'll get that without the beef, though. Can I get a, a, a Diet Pepsi, please? And can you guys double check and make sure it's diet? Just I'm really trying to watch my figure. Let's go, man. I have $22.50. Sweet. Thank you. Alrighty, guys. So it is 5.45 right now. Uh, I have the taco 12-pack right here. And then I also have a delicious and nutritious taco salad right there. Um, so yeah, this is definitely gonna be interesting. I just always wanted to order one of these. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, this is pretty awesome right now. So, uh, try this out right now. I got my water, I got a ton of sauce. And yeah, I'm just really craving tacos. I don't know what it is. One size feeds all, apparently. One Eric. Half of the store's supply of sauce. And of course, everybody, we're gonna start off with only the best, Cooler Ranch. And if you disagree with me, you're just crazy. Health and fitness, guys. Health and fitness. And of course, they also made sure to put soft tacos in here as well. Now, doesn't this just look so appealing? Only mild because I'm a little bitch. That inside though, look how appealing all of these just look. Oh, so delicious. Now this apparently is the Cooler Ranch Taco. That my friends is fire. I'm gonna be so pissed if they forgot to give me utensils for this. Taco salad dressing, anybody? I you're supposed to eat taco salad with just your hands or the taco shawl, which I might just end up doing here. Strong. Oh, there, there are beans at the bottom, delicious. Because sometimes they forget to give you forks when you go to Taco Bell, so you have to improvise and use the taco shawl. I love my creativity sometimes. It's like, it's not even shredded. <laughs> I don't know, I'm drunk on tacos at this point, so I don't even know what I'm doing. <laughs> That awkward moment where you have no taco shell left and just a bunch of salad. Fail. Good thing I just washed my hands. And as you guys can see, we are all done here. Now, I'll be hungry in probably about another hour. I'll see you guys in a little bit. Hi. Time for that last meal. Whew. I am ready to go. Ready to eat that last meal. Whew. I think I'm ready for it. 100 calorie pack. Come on guys. Do you actually think I was serious? And so, it begins.
Alrighty guys, so it's about 9 o'clock right now. This is the last meal that I have. I got a lot of food right here. I figured I'd end this with a bang. So right here we have the 100,000 subscriber red velvet cake, of course. A dozen donuts, two additional donuts, special edition, and a bunch of other stuff too that I did just receive that's 100% vegan. I just want to add from a subscriber in Israel as well, and I have no idea why, but I was just craving some good old-fashioned hash browns. So I got all these too, along with some whipped cream, and I wanted to try this habla halva spread. So we're gonna do this, but first, I'm gonna get to these donuts, and I'm gonna eat them as fast as I possibly can. Let's make some bad decisions. The glorious Krispy Kreme, let's do this. Five, four, three, two, one. So that's a dozen down imperative that we refill our milk here. Red velvet cake, one of my all time favorites. Now, the real challenge begins. Damn, that was rich. That is rich. Thankfully, I got some fat free Cool Whip. I'm just gonna balance this out. All right, you guys, I've had enough sweetness. I need some hash browns in my life. I know these are already cold. Now I'm not gonna lie, I completely forgot what these are, but they look delicious. Health and fitness, guys. Health and fitness. Poor almighty. Completely forgot what this is, guys, but this is the best donut I have ever had from Krispy Kreme. Holy shit balls. And next, guys, we have this one right here. I think it's like an apple cinnamon donut. Regardless, it looks delicious. Oh man. Killing it tonight with the donuts, guys. Killing it. Absolutely killing it. Now before I get to the rest of the cake and everything, I do have some of these treats that were sent to me. Reading off my Chi Chi here. Saucins coconut treats. So these look absolutely delicious. Have to admit, kind of a letdown. Sorry. Not a fan of that. These though I think I will like. They look like they're just cookies, but how could you go wrong with cookies? How can you go wrong, guys? Damn! Things taste like freaking Chips Ahoy. Seriously.
I just had to. And this is the halva spread, havlava. I'm probably just gonna get roasted for not pronouncing this right, but oh well. Oh, it's like a tahini spread, I think. But we are gonna try it on a cookie. Looks literally just like peanut butter. Hmm. Interesting. I'm actually really happy I got this cool whip. Like, I don't think you guys have any idea how happy I am I got this cool whip. All done, folks. Um, what else, what else? I don't think I'm gonna eat the entire pack of this, but more or less just curious to see what it looks like. Oh, I think it's like dark chocolate and milk chocolate. There's like another package that I got. I hope this is the milk chocolate one. Well, let's say milk chocolate because this is supposed to be vegan, so. Interesting. Hmm, it's chocolatey. Now that is where it's at. No, I really can't say I'm feeling this that much anymore. At least not in this challenge. These are cream filled wafers. Let's see these right here. Damn, those are fire. They look like fire. And they taste like it too. Now it's time to finish this damn cake. Really wish I would've just got ice cream or something. Oh my gosh, damn cake. It's like a cream cheese frosting too, it's the hardest part. Thank God for Cool Whip. The last piece of red velvet cake. This was hard, guys, but we did it. And already, everybody, this has been the 100,000 subscriber cheat day. Do me a favor, guys, if you did enjoy it, leave a comment down below. Give it a like. Follow me on my social media if you haven't already. Facebook, Snapchat, Twitter, Instagram. You know the drill. Thanks again for watching the video, guys, and go eat some cake. What does the scouter say about his power level? It's over 9,000! What 9,000? Oh.